Hey there, everyone. This is Al Carol playing uh, War WarioWare. We're doing we're doing Grid WarioWare again. I've just finished my first round uh, for you guys. It's a few hours later. All right, we're gonna be finishing Sci-Fi hopefully right here. Oh, I remember I remember struggling with this game. Stick and move. 15 points. You got a pesky samurai trying to stop you. It's pretty rude. Skip across the roof and avoid the samurai. The samurai's really sci-fi, maybe. All right, so you do that, and it's like, whoa, check it out, I got a Q-tip. It's like, whoa, I did it. Ba, 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 ba. For some reason, this was like the hardest game in the universe when I was playing the game for real. Right now, I'm just pressing the button. Everything's going okay, but maybe that's not gonna last. I don't know. Alright, okay. So you, there you gotta wait a little bit. You gotta wait for your timing a little bit. Hot cross buns. Oh, see, this is what would always happen when I was playing the game in the real game. Just wait a little bit. So here's the thing. The bomb timer, like, is like, oh, it's like, oh. I disagree. What? Uh... Like, maybe I shouldn't disagree, but I don't know. That did not look right to me. Uh, but okay, like, it's what, 25 too? I... but no. Like, how else do you do this? Otherwise, I'm gonna run out of time. Uh... That. Yeah, so, uh, 25? Is it really 25 I have to do? I didn't struggle at all in the previous one. 15! Still. Well, then, there I waited too long. <laughs> There's something about the timing of this that does not, like, click with my brain. generous, especially compared to other games. Oh, that wasn't good enough. Whoa, and that was not fast enough. Oh boy! Okay, okay, okay. Well, the winning run was pretty fun. So, I did. I won. Next game. Still at the Japanese Ninja Wall. Aerospace. 20 points. Sidestep. The arrows to spare yourself. Talk about... Hairy situation! It's pretty good. Because you get arrows in your hair, and that's embarrassing. Alright, sidestep. I'm side flipping. I did it! I sidestepped. Do this 20 times! So you see the pattern. You just kind of have to, you know, be able to. Alright, so that size is gonna look like this at this size. You did! This is extremely video games. Like, it's not rhythm, it's not, it's, well, I mean, video games is rhythm, but, like, this is pure, I'm playing a video game, this is what this looks like. And, uh, yeah, you know, it's like a bombs pattern, you know, it's, it's the armies over there. Oh, huh, really? I mean, I'm gonna be real? Didn't, what? Oh. This is fascinating, so, like, I don't have any problems on the left side evaluating things. Uh, I clearly got hit there. <laughs> but on the right side, okay, so I think what was happening is that my brain was not counting the full right side, if that makes sense. It's like if, like, the spot I was in wasn't, like, part of the part. But I have adjusted. Just means that I have a little bit less amount of lives, you know, for when things are harder. But, like, again, I feel like I clearly got hurt there. <laughs> I mean, if the game's gonna give it to me, the game's gonna give it to me. Yeah, so we're at the stage where you can't- Oh. You kind of 
kind of have to go like as soon as the arrows are 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 slung. Okay, so yeah, so I lost because of my training. My very early lives while I was adjusting to things. That's what ultimately ended me. So yeah, they're like my 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 instinct is that you are always going to have to move left somewhere, but that is just not an accurate statement. But that's how I was sort of like see here you're safe, yeah. Like sometimes you start in the safe area. I just, I just didn't see that at first, but then I did, and now I'm just kind of constantly belaborating that point, just without stop. It's pretty good. Fan of saying a whole lot of the same thing a whole lot. I'm gonna enjoy arrow whatever sweep hair. I don't know what what's the hairy situation. Like you only say that expression if hair of some kind or maybe a rabbit is involved. I'm not seeing. Is this supposed to be like a rabbit hunt? And that's a rabbit. It's in a ninja disguise that you wouldn't be able to tell. Oh, level three. Uh, the thing is pretty small. Like that's what the level difference does. It's it's the size of the gap. But yeah, like we're already at a stage where like you kind of already have to be on the way by the time the arrows are flung. And I'm not sure what to do about that. Like that's pretty hard. Uh, uh, like, there, that you need to be holding, dude. Dude, like how? How do you do this? You have to know. You just start by assuming you have to go left and backtrack, and we'll be fine. If you don't, I don't see how to do this. Yeah, this is 20 or 25. I might not have one, actually. Uh, I forget, actually. Okay, no, it's 20. But yeah, like, I... I don't know, this game kind of doesn't work at high speed, I feel like. Maybe it's just me, but it's the feeling I got. Wow, so playing these two took almost as long as doing all eight, all six up there. Pretty funny! Marsh Ball Destroy! Clear 15. Follow the... Arrow, find a red ball, and destroy it. Keep your wits about you! Move and shoot! We see that a lot in this thing. You go here and then, I, oh, you're dead, Mars. Get out of here. And yeah, okay, you cannot move while you're, you're, you're shooting. Okay, so that's how that's balanced. I can't just be mashing shots. Ah! I was trying to move down, but I was shooting at the same time. See, that's exactly what I was saying. Okay. All right. All right. Um, we're adapting. There we go. I thought there was a game where you move left and right a lot, but maybe it's not this one. Uh, okay. Got it. Da, 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 da. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. So yeah, easy is pretty easy. Medium is pretty medium, and hard is pretty hard. Wow. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> That, 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 uh, uh, so you go here, that's like, oh wait, this one was like straight in the middle. But that makes it a lot less hard, you know? Ooh. Right there, right in my face, like, immediately, looking pretty good. Oh, there you go. Da, 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 da. Oh, I was, it was earlier, really, oh shoot, there's two balls now. Oh, what? oh it's because there's a diagonal? You can just do that. No! <laughs> See, as soon as I start shooting, I cannot move anymore. I am dead to the world. Yeah, I did it! I got that one! Okay, so I think I want- Whoa! Okay, well, here we go. It's high stress, Wario. Yeah. 
uh, at the high movement, like, you, you lose a lot of flexibility. Man, that makes sense. I can't believe this is gonna be the last one. All right, look at that. It's Ninja Pipe. I don't remember that. Ninja Pipe Cleaner. It looks like a spider web. Find the oncoming ninja and take him out. Talk about a tough crowd. I don't get it. All right, I gotta move. I can do that. Strike! Oh, it's this one! Yeah! Get sliced! Uh, bah, 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 bah. Oh, and this one moves around! Pretty good! Uh, bah, bah, da, bah, pow. And this one uh, is like stagger moving. Alright. This is pretty violent. Like, you know, like the implication is you're a ninja just speeding inside the straw here, and it's like, you know, you see like the big. Oh. Okay, so this time we were like too far apart, so that plan didn't work. Got it, okay. So that, be careful with blue. Because like I feel like this is extremely straightforward. Purple's pretty straightforward, but blue, you gotta like intercept, you know, and yeah. Going against the grain to get to him, probably smarter than going after him. Oh, oh, oh there you go. Hey, look at that, it's red. Uh, now he's dead. It's pretty funny. Whoosh! See, this time I just- I was going right because I trained myself to go right. And it worked out, but, you know, it's only because it worked out. <laughs> Good. Okay, so... Uh, uh, oh, there we go! Violence is my name! Oh, trying to stagger step your way! It's not gonna work! Uh, he strike! Uh, that's right. What does it say in Japanese? You know, like the big kanji that it pops up. Like, Whoa, check it out! Is it violence? Is it super death? Is it garlic fart? You know, I want to know, because it's WarioWare. You, you, you don't know what it's going to say. Maybe it says Aardvark. Maybe it says, whoa, check it out. You know? It'd be weird. Wouldn't make a lot of sense, but... I missed. I overcompensated. Oh, shoot. And then here, I just went the wrong way. I think I lost. I think it's 25. No! You're wrong. It's 20. I do not remember these numbers. It's pretty wild. Mars Jars! Clear 15 points. You're in a tight spot here! Aliens? <laughs> Aliens are trying to trap your crew. So avoid their evil snares. Um, it's a uh, reverse alien capture. It's me, I'm the crew. That's a glass. It's a jar. Jar of glass. Check it out to me. We're the little guys. Yay, we did. We lived. Escape! Yay, we did it. The whole. I guess. I'm assuming I have to save the whole crew. I mean, to me, this reads more family because of the very obvious size differences between the various stick figures. You know, one went in visual design. The simpler the design of the character, the more the details matter. So if we're talking stick figures, the single simplest way you can represent a person beyond perhaps a single line or a dot, the fact that their sizes are so different, like there's a good half head difference between the leading figure and uh, the ones following him. Uh, assuming an, an age difference is like absolutely normal and so this is why this reads like a family rather than a crew like even though in real life you will probably have a crew that has you know a, a bigger guy than the other guys in a lot of groups I'm the bigger guys than the other guys doesn't count because Freddy's dead well, my point is this reads like a family not a crew so uh, there you go that is my that's my critique of what's going on here. It's 15, I've already won. Uh, I don't know if I want to try it too- Whoa, I went too fast there. See, because of the fastness? But, okay. You know what? It's okay. Because now I'm- All I'm gonna do is time a button. Bamfu! 20 points! Focus your mind and chop! Miss! And you gotta meet! The raccoon! What? I want to meet the raccoon, though. Well, I'm sure I'm gonna miss multiple times. Yeah, so this is this game. This is the third variant on this game. This is... Here's meter. Whoa. Did it. And you know, the higher the level, 
the less amount of let you got, which you know you got once. Two, oh, we met the raccoon! Raccoon on head. So I'll do this 20 times. Uh, without the failure part, if possible. That's my suggestion to me. But like, it's kind of hard because it stays on the top option, like, a small amount of time. Because uh, when it's a bigger meter, like, you get the way up and you get the way down to get it right. But when it's only one square, there's no up or down. There's just the one time it's there. Like, I understand why this is 20 points. Because the actions that you do, fundamentally, is pretty simple. You just press one button, right? But, I don't know, man. I feel like this is one of the hardest games, even though it's one button. Like, you just... You just you, the timing needs to be so good. I feel like I say this every time we play these minigames. But, look. It's because it's true, alright? The more something is true... The more people say it. Now it's just, is that true? Maybe, maybe more people need to say that, and then it'll seem true. Uh, see, things seeming true, though, that's a... That's a nasty trap. Like, you don't want to fall into that trap. Just because something seems true, like, that doesn't mean anything. It is the least valuable way. So, oh boy, okay, well, double raccoon out of noggin! I guess the game was tired of me flubbering and flustering about that subject. And I don't blame you at all! Alright, here we go! We did it! Sci-Fi Club is dead! You can see I already did the boss a thousand years ago! Next time we return to Wario... I don't know... I've got a choice of five more, oh man... Something something rhymes with hand. Next time, video game. Unbelievable.